Well, good morning, everyone. This is Mitchell Mander here, and I just need to keep my voice down as it's really early in the morning, and I just don't want to wake up anybody where I'm at. So, uh, anyways, what's up, everyone? So, I just wanted to provide a little bit of an update video as we have official confirmation that the Pokemon series that was, or that poster that was leaked on Friday for the upcoming Pokemon series was legitimate. And it is real, and it is going to be an hour special on November 17th, which is to be expected as Sun and Moon and X and Y did the same thing. But I am a little underwhelmed as I was expecting a trailer to drop because they've been kind of teasing this and saying that there's going to be a special announcement. So I was expecting like maybe like at least a 30 second trailer showcasing some of the upcoming series, but it appears that we're going to get more information in the upcoming week. So I'll probably um, report on that when we get more information. But for the information that we got this morning, we got some more information on the new character that's being featured in this upcoming series. This character, and I'm going to correct myself, is in my Friday video I said that this was a female, and it actually turns out that it's actually not. It's a male. Um, this character's name is Go, and so according to Serbi, I'm reading the details for this character. Go is a young boy just starting out on his Pokemon journey. His goal is to catch all Pokemon and eventually find the mythical Pokemon Mew. His partner Pokemon is Scorbunny, which we saw in the leak. So his name is probably a reference to Pokemon Go and Let's Go Pikachu and Eevee. Um, another interesting tidbit is that this character is actually voiced by the same voice actor that voices Izuku Midoriya Deku and My Hero Academia. And if you're a big fan of My Hero Academia, and I'm a very big fan of My Hero Academia myself, so this is actually exciting news for me. And if you're a fan of uh, Deku and his voice in Japan, Jap Japanese, uh, I think you'll like this too. And that's pretty awesome. I think this may be his first role in Pokemon. Um, I'm not, I don't have 100% confirmation on that, so if you want to correct me in the comment section down below, let me know. If he's been in other Pokemon episodes or voiced other characters, I'd be interested to hear. But anyways, um, I will say there isn't any other characters that have been announced, so we might have potentially more companions. But if it's just uh, Ash and Go, um, this has a lot of potential to, you know, really flesh out Go's character and develop him just as equally as Ash. And I'm very interested in his goal because I do like the fact that he wants to catch all Pokemon. Maybe he'll fulfill the gotta catch them all phrase. <laughs> and that'd be cool if, like, I expect him to eventually find Mew in this upcoming series. Maybe that's why they're traveling between all, all the eight regions. They're searching for Mew. And maybe they get, like, a glimpse of Mew. And then they move on to the next region and get a glimpse of Mew again. And just keeps going until they finally find Mew. Don't know, I'm just speculating here, but... This has a lot of potential to be really good, and a lot of potential to give as much spotlight to this character as Ash, as it seems as of right now we're only focusing on these two, but yeah. So that's all information I got for now. Um, leave your thoughts in the comment section down below, and be sure to like and subscribe, and I will report on this as, I, as we get more information. So uh, I will talk to you all later today when I do my impression video for episode 141. See you all later.